All right, so I want to tell you a little bit of the things that we're doing this week so that if you're at home, you can catch up. It's not a super tricky week, and I am going to record me teaching today's lesson so that then you can see exactly what we're doing in class on the writing assignment, but this will get you started on what we're doing, okay? So this week, you can come into your module. We're going to finish the three region superheroes. Let me screen share with you. One second. going to screen share my entire screen so you can come along with me. Just ignore that I have 752 tabs open at the moment, okay? All right, there's reason. Okay, so we are going to go in and you're going to see that you have Regions 3 superheroes. The first thing we did was we reviewed. We went and practiced the Kahoot. So before you take any of the tests, practice the Kahoot. That's super, super important, okay? Then you'll go down to the very bottom and you'll see these two tests right here, how the tribes use the land quiz and tribes and the land. I need you to take both quizzes. One of them is just multiple choice and it will look exactly like your Kahoot. The other one is me seeing you think and use your information, okay? So that's the first part of this week. The second thing that you're going to do is we're gonna come into the European American Exploration Impact and we're gonna start our reading. And this is the reading. You're going to go through and you're going to highlight reasons why the explorers came and what was that impact on the native tribes. Two colors that you're going to use. And you're just going to go through and underline like we did on our last one. Okay. When you're done with that, you're going to come in here to the next assignment, which is the exploration impact essay. So let's go ahead and look at that. It's going to make you make a copy. All right. So we're going to use our races format, okay? You're going to write two paragraphs. They both need to be written in correct paragraph format, which means you're going to restate the question and answer the question. Use that orange color for your topic sentence, okay? So as you restate and answer your question for each paragraph, the reasons for exploration were, and you'll put them in there, okay? Um, paragraph two, the impacts of exploration were, and you'll put your impacts in there. Then you need a quote from the article, which is why we've gone through and highlighted all of that information. Then you're gonna put that quote in red. Then you're gonna go blue and you're going to expand and elaborate on it. And then you're going to sum it up. Now remember, you have your racist cheat sheet. Maybe I'll put the link in there to it again, but you have your racist cheat sheet. You should pull that out and use it to help you come up with how to start these sentences. That should take us most of today, okay? When we finish that, we're going to go over some of the explorers that came. We're going to talk about Dominguez and Escalante. We're going to talk a little bit about our early wagon trains, okay? They're both just PowerPoints. Just go ahead and read through them. They're not super on the test, but it's good background information for what's coming. The Hastings Cutoff is a little project you get to do. You're going to read textbook page 88. Oh, look, there it is. Ms. Mac put it right in there. And oh, look, there's the map. Okay. You're going to make a poster to advertise the Hastings Cutoff because what happened was is people got super excited thinking there was a shortcut and it actually ended up being a super big problem. But you're going to pretend it's cool and you're going to advertise it. You need to draw a picture including all of those trails. So you're basically going to draw that map right there on your piece of paper, plain piece of paper. Okay, and you're going to explain why it's cool you want to use it, okay? And then you will take a screenshot of that and turn it into me. That is this week's work, okay? I am going to hopefully be able to post the video today of what we do in class and how I explain it so that you can follow along there, but this should be enough to get you started. But otherwise, get going. Thanks.